was doing the quest to Bloody Baron. And back when we found the agent's book, where he had notes written down about Siri, one of them was about the Bloody Baron, saying that she had visited him. Visited him. So we're going to check out this guy and see what he knows about Siri. If she did visit him, you know, if he knows where she's gone. Because we had a few leads um, from that book. The first one was the elf, or well, the witch, which led to the elf. And now we're going to do this other lead and see if we can get a bit more information. And find out a little bit more about where Siri might be. So we need to find the Baron. Apparently this is the Baron's castle we're approaching. Like, there's a little village surrounding the castle. So um, I'm going to follow the path. I'm going to call a horse. So we get there a bit quicker. So we haven't actually um, met the Baron yet. We don't know what he looks like, but we, he's known for having like a pretty violent reputation. They call him the Bloody Baron. That's his nickname. So um, we'll see how he is once we meet him. Maybe he's scared of witches. That's all we can hope for. So we're going around the side of the village now. This is like the gates leading towards the castle. Oh, hello. Baron home? Depends who's asking. A witcher. Want to talk to him. Hmm. Yeah. And I want to plow the lovely Queen Cero. Seen this man before. In at the crossroads. You brought us around. Oh, nice. As I recall, you were to go your separate way. Oh, shit. <laughs> so, um, yeah, we had the choice to kind of, like, fight those guys or buy them around. And I chose, like, the less violent option. I was hoping that he would be alright with that. <laughs> So I did, it led me here, that's a separate way. It led me here. Gotta talk to the Baron. Oh I? What about? Something important. His ears only. Fine. Lodrin, let him in. If he makes any trouble, well, we had none but him. Open the gate. Nice. Sergeant! Ardell! Witcher, to see the Baron. Don't want no disturbances. That clear? What do you think? That's pretty cool then. They let us in quite easily. I wonder if we didn't buy them a drink if they would have let us in. So I'm gonna follow the sergeant. I called you a sergeant. You a Tamarian soldier? Not your concern, mate. Deserter. Tamarian army don't exist no more. So what are you all doing here? Had a choice after the black ones thrashed us. Let it lie and try to lead normal lives. We'll continue to resist, join the guerrillas, and fight for our beloved Temeria till death do us part. We chose the former. And the Baron, your commander? Hmm. Yeah. Commander. Infosema! Now those were balls. Attended a few, me and my Annie. Oh, how we danced, how we twirled, ha ha ha! Ooh! One, two, three, one, two, three, ha <laughs> ha! Enough. I don't care how you do it, but the deliveries must be weekly. Won't you stay for tea? No. Besides, you've another guest. Look at that. Didn't even stay for tea. In spite of all that blabbering about how cultured the nation is. It's just that blabber. Didn't come here to chat. Rumors rarely find confirmation in reality, especially the ones about foreigners. <laughs> right you are. I'm... I know who you are. Believe I also know why you've come. We'll talk inside. So this is the Bloody Baron. Seems alright for now. Make yourself at home. It would have put the bloody vodka. Ah, there it is. A snifter. Um, no. No thanks. Didn't come here to drink. <laughs> As you will. But I'll not sit here a dry if you don't mind. Before the war, there was a distillery nearby, best in Velen. But the horse on was burnt it to the ground. To the matter at hand, I'm Philip Stranger. Now the blobtits round here call me the Bloody Baron. Geralt of Rivia. 
Blobtids call me the Butcher of Blaviken. I said already. I know who you are. Truth be told, it's the only reason we're talking. How do you like it here in Velen? Damn, it's awful. Lovely place. Get to the point. Lovely place. Lovely place. Swamps, bogs, marshes everywhere. Exactly. Someone loses their way around here, he becomes damn hard to find. What are you getting at? Many have lost loved ones here. Some their wives, others their daughters. Okay, can you get to the point? Is that a threat? We haven't spoken about Siri at all. Let's get to the point. Get to the point already. Siri, that's why you've come, isn't it? So she was here. She showed up some time ago, exhausted, wounded, and stinking like a soaked hound after a hard hunt. Later, I learned she'd come from the swamp. Flashback. Said some beasts from the woods attacked her before she could reach the village. She has grown up quite a bit, hasn't she? When we last seen her in that dream, she was only a kid. She's like a woman now. Oh, we're playing as her? What? Siri? When you play Siri, you can access the inventory or your signs. Okay. Just looking if I can pick up the... <laughs> The ingredients then on the ground. Seems you can, but it didn't give me didn't show me what they were. Whoa, 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 what's this? Circle does this. Is that good or bad? I don't know. If I, I don't know if I like that. It's a bit weird. It's hard to time it. Because I'm so used to playing as Geralt, you know, doing the role instead of that. You can come down. She's battered, isn't she? Why well, she got makeup on as well? Like if she's living in the wild, if you Hello like. There? Are you lost? A little, I guess. Are you? Um, yeah, I'm lost too. No, I never am. I guess she's lost, isn't she? Yes. Though also just a little. Does that mean you know which way to go? Not quite. Not yet. But I'm sure we'll find the way if we set off together. What happened to you? This? <laughs> it's nothing. How is it you're here? Where do you live? How did you wind up here? My father brought me. Told me to follow the trail of treats and eat my fill. He said he would wait. So I started down the trail. Then I saw a butterfly. And I ran to catch it. And I lost my way. Okay. Remember how to get home? You and your father. When did you leave home? This morning. And did the sun warm your face or your back? It warmed my back. So we must go east. Come, I'll walk you home. And explain to your parents that they must not lose their children in the woods. We can't go home because of the Wolf King and his pack. So if someone said to me, like a couple of hours ago or this morning, did the sun warm your face or your back, I wouldn't be able to tell them. I'm just amazed that she knew the answer to that question. <laughs> So don't be afraid, I'll protect you. So I've got it. Is this like an escort quest now, I guess? See what I've got on my back. That's Wolves. a sword. Kings do too. Come. I'll help you up. Uh. <sighs> Alright then, Siri story, follow Gret Gretka. She's got just as much good sense as um, Geralt with these yellow boots. 
Geralt wears like blue gloves, red top. She's like all multicolored herself. Alright, so we've got some wolves. Can I do the dash? Yeah, I can. Wait! Ow. She doesn't take much damage at all. And also, um... I'm guessing, like, the damp the wet weapons she's got are just, like, default. Doesn't matter what Geralt's using. It doesn't affect it. I mean, she regenerates her health in combat as well. You can come out now. My, you're brave. My father can even do that. Mine could do a lot more. Come. I mean, I don't mind playing as different characters in games, like side characters, but in an RPG, when you got attributes and like you're developing your character, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know if I like it. What is that? Is that her dad? Wait here. Don't come any closer. But no but stay here. I must see something. I could be her dad. Oh, that's pretty gruesome if it is. Oh, this head chest what? No. So I just click on one of these. Mm. Bloodshot. Still moist. He died recently. Lips parted and bloated. Bit clear through his tongue. He bit his own tongue. Before death. He bites his own tongue? Chest? Uh, his chest is crushed. Ribs probably pierced his lungs. Something picked him up and threw him against the tree. Is this like the big wolf the girl spoke of? Hmm. Something tore his leg off. No, gnawed it off. Ew, that's horrible. Stay there and look away. Hmm. <laughs> What's this? Marrow's missing. Interesting. Let's just sum it up. Everything seems to suggest a fiend. What happened to him? He had a fall. Mm, I bet. The Wolf King got him. <laughs> when do children get so smart? What will we do when the Wolf King finds us? Good question. I've no silver. But I can make a blade oil. Oil? You mean like we make from rapeseed? No. A far more special oil. Of dog tallow, bull's parsley... Wolf's liver and mistletoe. The fiend will feel terrible, terrible pain. You're smart. How do you know these things? Did your father teach you? Not my father. My uncle. Uncle Vesemir. Hmm. Cool. She got a pretty bad scar on her face, hasn't she? So we need to find these things. Didn't we kill some dogs behind us? Can we just get them? Surely they've got the dog tallow. Um, actually, wait there. The quest is to follow her, so I'm going to follow her and hopefully we'll find some on the way. I need to get some mistletoe. What's this? That's, that's not mistletoe. Mistletoe's like... Oh, uh, it's not... Oh, yeah, that, that's one. So they're white. We need to get fool's parsley. Some whatever that is. There's some more wolves. I love this music when you're fighting, you know, the <laughs> you know, when you're fighting as hit, it doesn't matter if you get hit. She just takes so little damage and then heals. You can come out. Mm, it's dead. But a pig here? Must be a human settlement nearby. Alright, so we got the um the dog tallow. Just need to find some um, parsley and mistletoe. What's this? Okay, that's parsley. So we know what mistletoe looks like when we're not. Do parents often send their children this is mistletoe. To the Sometimes they send their children 
Sometimes they go themselves. Mm. Belly's all in blood. Clawed open. No wolves did this. She can jump high, can't she? Look at this. <laughs> um, I didn't run past any more white flowers there, did I? Nope. So that should be mistletoe there, on the ground. Yep, just need one more parsley. And that's like a taller white plant. This way, through the cave. You lead. I think this is the mistletoe over here. Let's get this while it's there. Yep, not mistletoe, parsley, excuse me. Alright, I have everything. Now for a spot where I can build a fire, brew the oil in peace. Greasing my blade. There. We'll see just how effective Uncle Vesemir's formulae are. Alright then. So does that just like, even though we haven't got a silver weapon, that's just like a massive buff that will put like a dot on the the wolf, like dam damage over time, poison or something. Which is good enough. Didn't we just walk through there? We've just been here. So we must have went back to find a peaceful spot to make the fire. So we've got to run our way through here again, and then through the caves on the right, which the girl mentioned. Whee! So we're going through here, aren't we, the caves? Let's wait for the girl first. So when was the last time that like, Geralt seen Siri? It's a bit dark. Afraid? Are you? No. Here we go. Boss battle. <clears throat> what? The Wolf King, now do you believe me? I do. Hide. Is he a werewolf? The oil you made. Not unless we want to anger it. <laughs> Look at the girl. King of wolves, there we go. Whoa. I'm staggered there, bloody hell. Whoa, she does some mad damage. She does better damage than Geralt. Look at this! Destroy them! Stop that. Hit me all you want, I do more damage. <laughs> Let's speak to the guy then. Never seen anything like it. Go. You can come out now. Come on. So we must get to the village. We found a corpse in the woods. Let's just get to the village. You have bandages at home. Some spirit? He laid a claw or two on me, unfortunately. I've, I've not, miss, but my lord, he's a powerful man. He's sure to help you. Might even reward you for cutting the werewolf down. Very well. Lead us to your lord. A few hours later. Is this the bloody Baron? Yeah, that's him there, isn't it, on the right? That's his lord that he was talking about. I think you brought me, man. That's not me daughter. And the little one? Neither, damn it. I think I'd know my own child. Well, it uh, might, might not be yours, the older one, but you've got to admit the likeness. That's downright striking. So, any chance for that reward? You'll not see one fucking copper. Get out before I set my hands on you. So, stew any good? Very. Thank you. I'd not eaten in. Clear to see. I'm well, pleased you like it. Had them prepare a bath for you once you've eaten. And you could do with some sleep. Great care in the nook behind the hearth. You in the guest room opposite the kitchen. 
Thank you. I... Shh. Eat now. We'll speak once you've rested. Why has this guy got such a bad reputation? He seems really nice and like very welcoming. I don't mean bad reputation, I mean like violent. He's known as the Bloody Baron, you know? So I ordered my men to watch her and left her to rest. And? Ah, a topic for another time. I get what you're after. Tell me it's important. So he wants me to do something for him, I think. So um, let's see what he wants. Take it you won't give me this information for free. <laughs> Sharp you are. I regret your loss. Commiserate. But you see, it so happens my wife and daughter are missing as well. I propose an exchange. Find my loved ones, and I shall tell you about the girl you seek. All I know. Let's just... Uh, uh, let's just deal it. Come on. Fine. I'll help you. I'll find your family. But then you'll give me every bit of information you have. You have my word. <whistles> Guard! This man's under my protection. No one's to bother him in any way. Don't stare. I've not grown horns. Treat it as a token of my good faith. When do you see them last? They vanished after the new moon, as if whisked away by shadows. What do you mean, vanished? Precisely that. I awoke one morn to find them gone. All right, I need more information. I'll need to know a lot more than that. Can I see their rooms? What for? I need clues. Anything to latch on to. I'll not let a stranger pour through their belongings. Want me to find them or not? I do. Then let me work. <sighs> Fine. But I shall go with you. The doors are locked. Alright then guys, that's all we've got time for for this video. We will follow the Baron in the next video and see what we can find in his family's bedrooms. So thanks for watching and I'll see you next time guys. Bye.